you don't have to believe in tarot, do not exclude yourself from the message because this shit can actually happen. This is going to be a collective reading. All my information will be in the description box below. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this video. And if this is so, drop a tip in my cash app, leave a comment, and let me know. I also do personal readings. And tonight, I will be using the Kipper Oracle card deck as well as the Flicking on my meme Oracle cards created by me. Now, somebody may like their job. They may like their badge. I feel like somebody takes really pretty pictures. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna keep that center mass this reading. Somebody, ooh. Okay, so we got a couple that fell out. I'm not gonna take any of them. Somebody really likes their job. I feel like somebody may look a type of way that maybe they're not like so for instance if you look at this like i've had several people that tell me i look indian and i've had some people that tell me i look ethiopian even though i'm not that that's kind of what i mean somebody may um mistaken you for a different ethnicity especially while you're at work or you may dress a particular type of way you could be a chef and wear you know one of the hats that almost look like this I forget what you call them. Judication. So somebody may have to go to court. Somebody may, I feel like somebody, somebody works a job where they have to wear a badge. Not all jobs. Do you have to wear a name badge? Now it's very few of those jobs, but if you like work from home or something like that, you wouldn't have a need to wear a badge. But I feel like somebody might work like I said, if you go to like the courthouse, I don't really see people in the courthouse wear badges unless you're like security or something like that. But if you're a clerk or, you know, a judge or something like that, you don't walk around with a badge or an attorney. You don't walk around with a badge. And if you do have one on, it's when you walk in and they give you the, hello, my name is sticker badge mature man so this could be about a mature man i feel like somebody here makes uh makes uh makes decisions somebody has to read a lot of books somebody may also have to travel to certain places in order to perform this job so it's like a traveling teacher or a traveling mentor or maybe an attorney of some sort somebody that has to study something other than books maybe they have to look at um what do you call it like timelines or we got two that came what did i say didn't i say it was somebody that had to travel but i feel like whoever is traveling it's like maybe they're not getting paid enough i i, I don't know i'm picking up like a paralegal Somebody that may not get paid as much as an attorney does, but they have to do the work, they have to travel. And I feel like when somebody travels, it might break their pockets. When somebody travels, it I think it breaks their pockets or it puts them in poverty. Something to that extent. And this isn't gonna be a super long reading. I just kinda wanted to do one. But whoever this is, I feel like may have to travel different places for work, but it, it, it leaves them, it leaves them broke. It's not what you see, it's what you don't see. Yeah, I feel like this is somebody like a paralegal or an attorney or something like that. And maybe they have to research, study, research or study something in order to make a decision. It's like you got to look at you you when somebody presents their case, you got to also look at what they're what they haven't presented to you. I feel like somebody here is a paralegal or works in the justice system. Somebody might be a government official. Oh, two things. Okay, a couple things came out. Let's see what we have. Do your eyes have a face problem? 
So something about seeing something for what it is or so, it, it, again, it's not what you see, it's what you don't see. And then right after that, we got the do your eyes have a problem. So maybe somebody is not seeing, somebody is literally not seeing something. And the other person, it, it could be two people, but somebody is like, do you have a problem? Like, do you, do you not see what's going on? I feel like, again, this could be like a, 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 a somebody that caught a case. Um, this this happens when a dude leaves you for this a wreck when somebody somebody i feel like somebody may have been having relations with somebody on their job and now they've possibly broken up with this person and no longer engaging in sexual activity with them yeah somebody is mad and it's like i don't want to be with you no more or i don't Somebody is like, you know what? It's kind of like if if a paralegal had a prostitute for a client and the prostitute was like, okay, we together, you helping me on my case. I don't, I shouldn't have to pay you. And they're like, no, even though you a prostitute and I fuck with you like that, you still got to pay me for my work or my services. And they're like, you know what? Fuck you. I don't have to pay you for nothing. You're supposed to be my attorney. And you know what I'm saying? This is a situation like that where uh, somebody is take somebody may be taking advantage of who they're working with or who they're working under or for or something like that. Somebody, somebody is, somebody is like, you know what? It's okay. I don't need you. I'll sleep with myself. And maybe you thought I needed you, but I really don't need you. Like, yeah. So whoever this is, is mentally depressed. Cause it's like, even though, listen, I'm your, I'm your, I'm the, I'm the attorney helping you or I'm the paralegal or I'm the clerk or whoever it is. And I'm helping you. And we just so happen to engage sexually with each other or you become a romantic interest. Maybe you found this person while traveling for work, but it's like now somebody, somebody has an issue with you or somebody has a problem, but why? Maybe you didn't win their case, chilling all day since forever and still get my shit done. See, I feel like whoever the paralegal is or the government official, it's like, listen, I have the means, I have the funds, I have the job to be able to chill however I want to. And maybe you're not seeing that. See, you think because I'm working for you that I got to be up and moving around or doing this. or I don't have to do the things you think I have to do. Look, you say you be eating, but you ain't seen a meal. Like whoever this is, is like, yeah, you think because... You think because you got it like that, and they probably do. You think because you got it like that that you can, you know, treat me any type of way or do this or do that. So somebody, it's just like the 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 attorney client is not a privilege in this case. You know what I'm saying? The attorney client is not a privilege in this case. Everybody getting slept with. Yeah, so it's kind of like, listen, I was the attorney. I slept with my client and that's really all it was. You were one of my clients that I found a, a some type of an interest in, but now I no longer want to deal with you in that way. And somebody is like, oh, so you just use me, but you use them. You use them to fight your case and they used you for sex. Like, yeah, look, what did the vegan, what did the onion say to the vegan chef? Cut me and I'll make you cry. Don't worry about the nail, y'all. Okay? So, yeah, this is a situation right here where I feel like somebody is... I feel like the client and the 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 attorney and the client came together, but one is lesser than the other. Where, look, where looks don't matter. So, it's like if the attorney fucked with a prostitute and you be looking like... As an attorney, why are you messing with a prostitute? You couldn't get nobody better. You you got a better job. You got better money. Like, yeah, you tickle me this color pink. This makes somebody laugh. 
Maybe y'all got kids together. Maybe somebody got kids together. Look, living cheap is expensive. So somebody, I, I'm telling y'all, this is one of those situations. Look, you can have your donut and eat it too, but do not take off my plate. Like, but don't touch mine is what this say. So yeah, this is a situation where somebody is like, listen, you, you, I liked you even when you were cheap. I liked you even when you weren't expensive. Uh, living cheap is expensive, which is how you living. But I was doing you a favor and I'm laughing at you. You tickle me this color pink because it's like, why are you acting like this with me? Why? You acting like I don't got it like that, but you the one really don't got it like that. And this person done slept around and had multiple kids. So client, a client is dealing with, an uh, attorney is dealing with their client, but their client is possibly like a prostitute or possibly somebody who sleeps around or gets around something of that nature y'all i ain't, i'm not i'm i'm not surprised if you don't you better